What's up, everyone? Happy Wednesday. Or a pretty night. If you're not outside, get outside. Storms are coming. Got a little chillier from today, but uh, it's a beautiful night out. Over here at the Garden of Forgiveness, Steve McDonald, uh, in memory of Steve McDonald. Garden of Forgiveness, right here in Westwood Park in Malvern. Beautiful spot. Um, you're looking for a place to come sit and think. Uh, great spot, pretty spot. Oh, the lights just turned on, check it out. Pretty with the lights on. So uh, a lot of people put a lot of effort into this park and uh, in memory of uh, Steve McDonald, who's a great guy. And uh, love is the way. Gardener forgiveness wants to forgive. So I gotta get your message of the day. Uh, let's see, what do we do today? I worked on uh, some AutoCAD drawings, did some real estate stuff. Got some stuff going on there. Everything I have now is in contract, so that is pretty cool. Um, I need some new listings. Anyone thinking of selling? Um, I got buyers like you can't believe, and I got nothing to sell them. So um, thinking of selling, reach out. But uh, that's it for the commercial. Uh, let me talk about the message of the day. So one of my clients reached out to me today, and he says, I got to tell you, I've been going to some open houses, and I've been talking to some other realtors at open houses, um, just in the neighborhood, just poking around, see what's out there, see what's available to buy. And uh, he says, I got to tell you, he goes, outside of you and your team, he goes, all these, all these realtors are nasty. They're obnoxious. Um, they don't know what they're talking about. And he was really turned off by it, which sounds good to me. Now, not all, I know I got a lot of good realtors out there in the world that are friends of mine, but there is a factor out there of realtors that really are just obnoxious. And they don't know their topic and they treat people like crap. They feel like they got a chip on their shoulder. They talk down to people. Uh, they're not educated on their property. They don't know what's going on. And when a client comes in, it's a bad experience. And this makes me think about <clears throat> everything in their life. Um, how are you treating people? It's all about relationships, right? So if you treat people right and you give them knowledge uh, they're going to want to be with you. They're going to want to work with you. They want to be around you. But if you're nasty to people and you talk down to people and you think you're better than people and you're not knowledgeable of your subject matter, whether it be real estate, whether it be uh, cars, whether it be whatever it is that you're selling, uh, if you don't have knowledge of your product, um, <laughs> you're doing yourself a disservice. People aren't stupid. People realize you have no idea what you're talking about and they realize that you're lying to them and making up stories. So do yourself a favor. If you're out in the sales world, learn your product. Know about the house. Know about the neighborhood. Um, know about the features of the house. If you're selling cars, know about the size of the motor and the options that are available and whatnot. Um, if you're out there selling something, know your know your product. And treat your customers with respect. Um, I've seen it myself. When you go in and sales people really just think who they are. They think, uh, you know, they're better than everybody and... Uh, they talk down to you and it's like, uh, it really, uh, really turns you off. I was at Tiffany's over in uh, Manhasset a couple years ago and my wife wanted to get a piece of jewelry fixed, Tiffany jewelry fixed that had broke. And the lady was so obnoxious behind the counter that I told her I'll never buy anything from Tiffany's again. And uh, she got a bunch of Tiffany stuff. Of course, everyone loves a little blue bag. And this lady was so obnoxious behind the counter talking down to us. And it's not like we don't have jewelry and stuff that, you know, it's not like we're homeless people walking off the street. And she was talking down to us like we were second class citizens because we wanted to get this piece of uh, Tiffany jewelry fixed. And it turned me off to the point where I don't even think about Tiffany's anymore. I think they're overpriced anyway, but uh, that's besides the fact. But um, if you're in sales and you're not treating your people right and you're not making friends, and you're not building relationships. Um, it's not even just in sales, just in life. If you're not treating the people around you right, and you're cranky and you're obnoxious, and you think you're better than people, um, you're not going to get far in this world. So check yourself. Check yourself. Think about it. How do you talk to people? Even if you're in a bad mood, everyone's in a bad mood once in a while. You got to check yourself. You got to make sure that your bad mood's not coming out and getting the people around you. But it'll turn people off. People won't come back to you. You leave a, a bad taste in someone's mouth from treating them nasty and uh they're gonna remember it um so there's your message of the day if you're out there in sales 
don't be obnoxious be friendly know your product um build relationships in the world and uh you will get far in life all right so let's jump on prayer strains coming in the father son holy spirit amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to treat each other with respect, to treat each other the way we would like to be treated. Help us to always be giving, and always be caring, and always putting other people first before our own needs. Um, help us to be successful in life, in both financially in relationships and our families uh, that we may have the easiest lives we can help as many people as we can amen all right so we got a crowd watching here what's up everyone it's a beautiful night get outside enjoy it i'm gonna finish up my ride here message of the day be nice to people build relationships that's what life is all about if you're not building relationships especially if you're in sales if you're a cranky person you're in the wrong line of work Lose the crank. If you're in a bad mood, don't let it show. Put a smile on. Say hello to everyone. Shake everyone's hand. Ask everyone how they are. Generally care about people. Generally help people. Go give. And uh, you will be successful in life. All right, everyone. Appreciate you. Put, the head on, put your head on a pillow every night knowing you're making the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go. Love to you all.